Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your weekly spread. Uh, this will run from uh, September 8th through the 14th. Um, this is how you're coming into the week. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. This is the energy in the environment. This is what's helping Aries. If this reading resonates with you, please like, share, comment. It helps the channel. Subscribe. All right. The outcome or the end of the week. Okay. All right. So Aries, this is how you're coming in the week. The full night nice. Aries, Aquarius, energy, Uranus, starting over, taking a new path, new development, leap of faith, risk. Hopefully it's calculated. The environment is the three of pentacles. You get new partnership, new agreement, new contract. Uh, this is newness and this is the establishment of uh, this is you working towards um, a status change the four of pentacles this is uh, how maybe you're communicating you're communicating nonverbal and verbal it's about the money it's about relationship it's about contract you are communicating that you're trying to get a, a grip, a hold on your stability, and you're working towards it. Nothing more, nothing less. You may even be getting recognition for a job well done. People see you on your way. Um, you may be even addressing some early childhood learned uh, foundational you know, uh, methods of, of doing, uh, early, early childhood learning, uh, revamping or revising or coming to a place of, of settling with that. If it was good, if it was bad, indifferent, whatnot. You may be partnering here because people see you moving towards a, a position of stability. What's helping you or who's helping you? The Knight of Cups. All right, so you have inspiration. You have inspiration in regards to a new endeavor. You have someone offering a cup of love, uh, the emotional investment. I want to em emotionally invest in with you. Uh, you um yeah there could be like some 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 venture here that you you are going after it's inspirational it's um emotion based it brings you a lot of joy elation the outcome to the end of the week is eight of pentacles wow you're working really hard Virgo, it's Virgo season. Getting serious about either yourself, your health and well-being. Getting serious about your money. Getting serious about the cultivation of some long-term goals. Um, how far are you off from it? Keeping your head down and working towards. Um, perfecting your craft. Learning. Going back to school. Merging. Um inheritance investments loans the big money issues really evaluating those things while wow, the two of cups at the bottom of the deck either because there's a person or there's a situation there's a business contract there's a connection that is mutually based it's mutual uh, one hand feeds the other or, or gives to the other uh, the business relationship it, it marries you perfectly you have found inspiration or new inspiration and a new development where there is the, the the ebb and flow the give and take definitely something cyclical with the eight of pentacles the money is in and out it's coming new contracts 
whatever you're doing it, it's hand to hand it's uh, a service it's a uh, commerce or e-commerce it is eight of pentacles it's a revolving door something about you having cultivated a level of money doing this for you you know it's cyclical which is good this may even be an Aries who has cultivated a business or, or really getting a foundation on something that where they make money in their sleep as I say that I'm looking at the bottom of this deck and we have self-employment for some of you it could be just that let's pull an angel answers card I, I didn't shuffle those so that but that card was at the bottom of the deck self-employment this talks about money material possessions what you do habitually there has been something that the Aries has been putting time energy effort into cultivating it's been feeding you you've been feeding it and now you're in a place of of now there's a roundabout and that's good when it comes to money you want to be on a roundabout with money maybe not with a toxic relationship but um, definitely with, with money this is really good for it um, some areas that I'm speaking to we're in Virgo season so things are about to get serious and get uh, yeah serious money related work related that's the Virgo card so a lot of these readers for for me for any reader on YouTube you're going to them and you're looking for love messages make sure that that reader has specified that's a love reading because a lot of the energy now is about most people getting serious about their money serious about either the division or the addition of or uh, the subtraction of what is tangible and what is foundational um so a lot of the readings are going to be geared toward uh, what you're doing every single day that the two the twos talk about um, habitual habits okay we have a yes answer wow Aries this reading is phenomenal I'm my rising sign is Aries I'm, opportunity at the bottom of the deck this is absolutely gorgeous um, okay and I, as I pick up the deck I haven't even shuffled it well, I did shuffle off camera this deck but at the bottom of the deck it's the ace of pentacle aries this is a new start to business to a business you have a business or you need to start one right now this week this is the week take that leap of faith uh, self-employment at the bottom of this deck ace of pentacles at the bottom of this deck you have a yes answer two of cups talks talks about of course um mutual emotional um feelings between the two but it also talks about because in most decks it has the the caduceus uh, if i'm pronouncing it correctly it talks about the hand-to-hand -hand exchange the bartering the 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 commerce you i give you you give me possibly money this is what the aries is or has cultivated this is i'm excited i'm excited if you cannot hear it <laughs> i'm excited for the aries um I'm going to go ahead and take this one out. We do clarify our yes answers here at the uh, channel. So let's go ahead. Oh, and it popped out. Yes. Wow. Yes. The ending of hardship, of disappointment, of feeling backed into a corner, of... Uh, of feeling downtrodden of bad times that will you know the will of fortune is what the 10 card so it says that the bad times are over for you Aries you coming into a place I didn't even do anything you coming into a place of wow some some really foundational energy you this has come because you've governed yourself accordingly you've got under some rule and regimen about yourself okay and you shifted the energy and into growing something or this is what you need to do you shifted the energy into growing something new change your entire life this could even could be a relocation once again 
excuse me, once again, another two talks about money, material possessions. Wanting to grow some new position and growing it and getting the money. It's still very new, but it's still it's still abundant for you. Aries, this is absolutely beautiful. Um, we're going to continue this over at the website. This is, especially for my Aries who have started business. This could be love. We'll see what comes out. This could be anything. But we're in Virgo season. Talks about work. Put that work in. All right. And opportunity at the bottom of this day. Opportunity. The opportunity is here. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, all right, Aries. I'll see you on the other side. Remember to stay in prayer. I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, Aries.